Hi, good evening, everybody. The high school baseball softball playoffs heating back up tonight. Cal Allen opened a best of three series against Bernie up in Beeville. All eyes on this man right here, Steve Chapman, because a win tonight will put him into a tie for most wins by a high school baseball coach. Numero uno was on the line tonight. We began, he began tonight 1,114 career wins along with three state titles. No doubt one of the greatest baseball coaches ever. But he had a pretty tall task tonight, going up against a very good Bernie team. And Bernie jumped on him for some runs right here in the get-go. They came out swinging the bats, already up one zip. And that was Tyler Garianto ripping a shot to deep right field. Two runs in score. And uh, that young man would wind up with a three-bagger. And it was 3 nothing in the top of the first. We head to the bottom of the first now. Wildcats trying to answer with some runs of their own. That's Braden Sprinzel, base hit right field. Ethan Salinas comes to the pay station, and that got the Cal Allen fans excited, and for good reason, because the Wildcats would rally all the way back. They'd wind up winning tonight. 12-6, your final, and there he is. Steve Chapman picks up career win, 1,115, tying him with former Lubbock Monterey coach Bobby Bagel for the most in Texas high school baseball history. He can break that record on Saturday. Big time congrats to him. And I think he'll do it Saturday. All right, let's head up to San Antonio at UTSA. Bishop taking on Blanco in game one of their Class 3A regional semifinal. That was Brian Buchanan sends this one off the second baseman's glove. Marcus Hernandez is able to score. It's one nothing early. And then Buchanan with a strikeout of his own. He pitched tonight. He was just a, he was doing it all tonight. Seemed like later in this game, all tied at one in the third. This is Ty Odom. Remember, we heard from him last night. He goes over third base. Hernandez is going to score, and this is going to make it two to one. And Bishop was on their way. They rolled to an eight to three victory tonight. So they take game one, game two, and game three if need be. We played Saturday afternoon again up at UTSA. All right, speaking of Bishop, their softball team was back in action tonight over in Sinton, taking on top ranked Hallettsville, game two of their best of three series. They needed to win two games today to advance the state, but Hallettsville, again, they're the number one team in the state. They were very good on defense as well. You can see there many a time tonight, the Lady Badgers had players in scoring position, but Hallettsville always seemed to come up with the big play on defense, and they were also doing it with the bats as well. They would go on and win this game. Final score, three zip. They sweep the series still. We want to congratulate Bishop on a fantastic season. All right, let's head back to the baseball playoffs now. Georgetown has beaten Ray in game one of their best of three series. Four to two is your final. They'll play again tomorrow in San Antonio. And in also in class 4A, we can tell you, this is actually uh, 3A. London beat Lago Vista. Final score of eight to nothing. And the Pirates take a one game and none lead. And uh, hopefully they'll go on to win that series as well. And Dale.